Really? You come to get me, and then now you're just sitting there. I'm ready, and you're just messing on the phone. Come on, let's go. Here. Uh, wheelie? Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. No time to waste. Oh. Oh. Gotta go to the, after we move these, I got to clean up some of the tanks, and then uh, we got to um, head down to the airport. So now, I'm taking this albino black diamond. Oh. You showing them? Yes, really? Okay. Are you serious? You scared them. It's okay. I didn't think it was going It's fine. So now these these two are going to go in the tank over there. Um, this one is a, a head, so that's a, that means it's a genetic carrier of the albino black diamond gene. So now we're going to... So basically, I'm just juggling stuff around, putting them into better situations. I had grew these guys out in this tank, and now I feel that it needs a bigger tank to grow out in. So... There we go. Okay, stay calm, stay still. Don't freak out, there we go. Black diamonds are much more calm than pearls, hopefully. Don't make me regret my words. <laughs> there we go. It's grown quite a... Whoa! Oh! I knew it, see? Once I say something, oh shoot, my ladder. Hold on. Oh, oh, let me sit in here so it doesn't. Can you grab my ladder? It's behind this phone here. Behind the phone. Just stick your hand behind the phone. Slide the ladder up. So I want to put this on the top tank. Okay, here we go. Of course, I had spoken too soon and it started thrashing. Stay calm. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. What is wrong with these guys today? <laughs> it's not me. I'm being gentle. I'm being nice. I think it's you. It's not me. It's you. Oh. Careful. I know. Okay, you ready for it? Yes. Here he comes. Come on. See there? He's suctioned onto the <laughs> bottom right now. I can turn it upside down and it won't come off. Watch. See? <laughs> <laughs> He's like a suction cup. He doesn't want to come off now. Come on. Come on. There we go. All right. See, much nicer, bigger home for you. And you give me a hard time. Okay, next. Go. Okay, next. What were you saying? Nothing. Nothing? You sure? Uh, my food now. If you guys don't speak Thai, she's saying never mind. <laughs> but I knew what she was going to say. <laughs> she's saying that I opened my mouth too soon and I jinxed the whole thing. <laughs> oh, that's so smart. Okay. Hey. So, in one of my previous videos, we were talking about horny teenage males and beating up the females, right? So another reason why I need to start moving these also is because that that male that I just moved, his claspers are starting to come out. And uh, so he's going through that um, adolescent stage and he's been chewing up on this female. You see, come take a look. You see this? Oh! See, it's you. No, it's you, okay? Once you came by. No, it's not me, it's you. Okay, look, I'm trying to show everybody the side over here. It's all chewed up. You see it over there? Yes. Get straighter, flatter. Mm -hmm. Yes, right there. Mm -hmm. So he started chewing up on her. And oh. so what I'm going to do now, since I have a top tank and a bottom tank, I'm going to separate them and continue to grow them onto maturity without him feeding on her anymore. So this way they can both grow better. So overall, this move is better for everybody. Better for the fish, you know, better for us, better for breeding. Somebody's calling. It's just leave it. Okay. Um, all right, let's pause for a second. Let me figure out what's the next tank I want to move, okay? So we're going to move a couple out of this tank. What we have here are some more 
uh, genetic carriers, which we call HETs, of the albino black diamond genetics. So I'm gonna put them together into that tank as well. so much easier to work with. So is this one going to splash you or no? No. Okay. Okay, and also for all you guys watching, um, the comments in the last video, I appreciate you guys uh, putting some support behind my wife for helping. And uh, if you guys care to know, her name is Oi. In the comments, people were like thanking Mrs. Stingray Biology, which was hilarious. But uh, her name is Oi, O-Y. Okay, here we go. And this is another female as well. So. There she goes. I figured out what I wanted to do. So these other two here are not genetic carriers, but the other one was, and I was debating whether to, or not to throw it in there with them. And I decided, you know what, I am. So this way, uh, when they're ready to breed, um, the male can make these two also, and then create more heads for me as well. So in the meantime, I'm just gonna dump them in there. And uh, in the interest of saving time, I'm gonna try to put both in one basket. Again. Again what? Doing something stupid? Yes, always. Well, I'm running out of time. We still have more fish to move. I still have to clean these tanks. So? Show them the rays. Okay, oh, this guy's feisty. Come on, come on. If we did not gonna hurt you, if they took one fish, take one fish. Hurt me. The one at a time, you know. I know. The risk of doing this is if they crash in the container, they might stab each other. Okay, that's the risk of doing this. Whatever. Uh, let me get rid of some water. Okay, not too bad. Whoa! <laughs> it would have been all over your face. <laughs> Come on, move. Oh. Be careful, don't slip, it's wet. What are you showing them, the floor? I have to walk backward, dude. Then let me walk first, then. Okay, then go, sir. Uh. Seriously. Any of you guys work with your wife? I know Rodrigo does, but anyone else out there? They'll understand what we deal with every day. Okay. See? Two at once, save some time, no problems. Yeah, right. There we go. Okay. All good. Ah, this two is nice. Okay, come on, stop wasting time. We'll show them in a in another video updates of everything, okay? Yes. Um, that tank is done. And then we're gonna move some other rays into this tank right here. Alright, so we'll be right back. We'll be we're moving these big spots. It's about 13 inches now too, so they're ready to get out of here. Oh come on, stay calm. This container is a little bit small, but it still should work. Okay, just a minute, Kim. Okay, see? When I have control of the net, everything is fine. When we did that albino, like I said, the net kept getting in my way. Okay, get rid of some water. There we go. Ah. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. oh! I banged into that thing and Seriously. scared them. Okay. Ouch. Alright, show them from the side. Here we go. There's no one to come out. Suction onto this one again. Oh, there we go. It's very nice. 
Wow, those spots are big. Mm -hmm. You couldn't tell before in that little tank. But now with the other rays next to it, you can really see the difference, how big their spots are. So, okay, let's do the bigger one first. So now my only hesitation here is that this one is a female and the other ones were males. So they might bother her a little bit, but she's growing really well. She's probably bigger than the rest of them. So hopefully she can hold her own in that tank. Okay, come on, get in there. Holy crap. All right, I'm not gonna say anything on this one, okay? Let's see what happens. Wow. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go before she gets. Oh, sorry. Ouch, you go for it. Oh. This thing has huge spots. Holy cow. Okay, here we go. Wow. <laughs> you see, they're like ping pong balls. Mm -hmm. So I show them that one and I show them that one. You see the difference? Alright. Again, you have something to say? Go ahead, say it. Right. While we were off camera, I was debating with her whether I should take this one and move it up to the top and put a little bit more size on him before releasing it with the others. But she's saying. Just move it all at once. All right, so happy wife, happy life. Even if the fish gets hurt, right? Well, we'll see what happens. Because the, the other guys that are in the tank to begin with, they are a little bit aggressive. Mm -hmm. Really nice. Really nice, yeah. okay? Yeah. <laughs> now, you know why? I don't want to put him in there. It's, it's so nice. I don't want to see it get damaged. We yeah, have that. no Look at that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> right? Yeah. Once it gets damaged, it's, it's not going to look as nice. Mm, okay. Ready? Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, there you go. So nice. Off to get destroyed by the other big boys. See? So <laughs> Okay. Let's go. <laughs> I know, I know, it's a nice shape. Okay, let me rinse this off and then uh, we'll start uh, moving some other. In this tank, I expect them to grow a lot better. Um, this tank will probably buy me a couple more months and then I'm probably going to have to move them again or thin it out and leave a couple behind and they'll be able to breed in there. But all of them in there, probably a little bit too much fish uh, for breeding. All right, so um, on to the next tank. Okay, so the last tank is a very simple one. It's some of these little pups and uh, these, I'm just going to net them over from this tank over to this tank. Okay, these are pretty fish as well. That's pretty much all the fish that I'm going to move today, guys. And then uh, what we're going to do now is clean up these tanks. I don't think I need to show you that. I'm just going to basically wipe them down clean some filter pads and do a water change and then these tanks will be ready for tonight okay stay tuned we have a lot of really cool stuff all right so we will be doing the acclimation see you later <laughs>